you've just been honored by your peers, by your fellow casting directors. How are you feeling? I'm, I'm, I'm blown away because I love Linda Lemontaine so much, and I'm always against her every single year, and she wins every year, and rightfully so. And so this is a thrill for me. You know, every project has its own unique challenges and opportunities and memories. What's one thing about this particular project you'll carry with you going forward, one memory or thought? Well, the thought is that when they showed me the pilot, they'd already done the pilot. They never used a casting director for the pilot, and then they knew they got picked up and they needed to hire somebody for the series. And they showed me the pilot, and I was like, I don't care what you pay me, I am doing this TV show. I fell in love with it instantly. And so it's always just been such a joy for me now going into, you know, we're in our fifth season, going into our sixth as well. And to be able to share that with my son and my husband it's like our favorite show so it's really a thrill is there something specific about casting animation that really attracts you very much because so many actors are attracted to it and you know you can sort of just throw it out to anybody that you think oh they'll, they, they'll never do it they're a huge star but they know they can show up in their pajamas and record it in a couple hours and see themselves in animation form and so everybody loves to do it and congratulations again, and now you. that you're an award-winning casting director, is there a piece of advice you would have for younger people looking to come up through casting, associates or assistants who are looking to be CSA casting directors? Well, I mean, what I would say is just work your bones off, you know, start off at the bottom and intern and be a reader in an office and work for free and do whatever you can do to get there because that's what I did and you know you literally work your way on to the top and 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 not that I'm at the top but you know what I'm saying <laughs> you have to really start at the bottom it's a very competitive um, job because it's so much damn fun but you really have to be willing to do the work and you know hit the ground running and believe in yourself well congratulations thank again you thank you so, so much thank okay. you um, and forgive me if you left it with her is there a difference between casting for I mean, for sure, because like I was saying, you know, a lot of times actors want that sort of, they want to have themselves preserved in terms of seeing themselves in animation form, you know, like everybody wants to have a cell Especially of themselves, the exactly, and want to be able to look, look, this is daddy, um, and so that's really a thrill for a lot of the actors, plus you can show up and do your work in an hour and not do hair and makeup, and literally, I've seen people show up in pajamas and slippers, and so for them, I think it's a lot easier, and for us, it's a lot easier to get people to commit to that than... And by the way, we don't have them commit to a seven-year series. It's not exclusive. You know, they can do other projects as well, which is really obviously appealing to the actors. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh.